Now here we go, the John Tully trip to uh, Maligal. Now as you can see here, we've got an absolute huge, huge number in the wagon train, Pilgrim. So it's just fantastic to see so many people so interested in our local history. Well done John Tully, the Denali Hysterical Society and all those who participated. Really looking forward to this one. So we've got an absolute huge number and a lot couldn't come. Fantastic. Here we are at stop two of the John Tully Maligal tour. He hasn't started telling us where we are, so we're somewhere. Now you can see the cars. There we go, the last one's just coming up now. So that's an extremely good representation and a huge uh, compliment for the quality and the interest which will be shown here. So thank you John and thank you Historical Society. So here we are, stop three. It's Maligal just over the other side of that paddock. This is obviously low, it's been well pastured. And there's the front of the convoy. And you can see them right cars all the way up there. So as you can see from this area here. There's a lot of diggings, you can see the undulation, it's my darling. So I've got an old stone shed over there somewhere, there it is. So I would say this is probably going to be the initial um, start of Maligal or somewhere pretty close by. Here we are, just north of Maligal. This is the site of the um, Maligal State Battery. So you have a look, this is where the actual water would run out. And it would come up through there. The big bolts there. Service uh, for the miners, so the miners could bring their stone here yes. and at a six shilling a ton, they'll be, have it crushed for you. We've got the battery What's here. The, the Maligal um, battery. Here we are, this is our lunchtime stop. We're right at the top. Up the Maligal. So here we are, Mount Maligal, with John Tully and the Denali Historical Society. Thank you very much. 
here we are in Maligal, our water stop. So just here we've got the uh, Flynn Memorial. John Flynn, the founder of the Australian Inland Mission and the Flying Doctor Service. Lovely little spot. And across the road here, we actually came and photographed this a few years ago, and it's really, really sad to see how it has deteriorated. That was an outhouse. So, again, you can see just a beautiful little setting underneath this huge peppercorn. And there the tree is virtually resting on the roof of it. Now as you can see it's really really looking sad. But a piece of character straight across from the Flynn Memorial. So this is stop four. Maligal in the gold fields. Just over that hill is the main highway, which is where uh, we'll, we'll call it a small satellite town actually operated. It was there back in the early mining days. They first found the gold when they were digging the roads around about 19, 1920s. So you can see there are lots of people. Quite undulating area here. And again, you can see the cars. Just beautiful, beautiful countryside. So you can see we're right down in a valley. And there's absolutely beautiful uh, water catchment there. So where we're standing here, you're just over behind John, was the... Um, very, very early cemetery, which was known as Maliagal, or not. But, um, thank you. Yeah, here we are in a nice little, looks like a man made waterway. You can probably see the fences coming down through there. And then you can come along through here. You can see this is a obviously a man-made yeah. man-made waterway. So the water would have come down around here with a beautiful old oh, seasoned timbered. She wouldn't I love to take that home? <laughs> yeah, well, the upright. Thing. Yes. And then you can have a look where that tree is, right in the middle there. That actually surrounds that you would see that there's um, rocks all the way around it. So this is the Lyagle Reservoir. So, so this would be where the office probably was, or a house. Looks like a cornerstone there. Uh, yes. Uh, so we've got the bank, the overflow, and there's a little bit of the original post and rail fence left. And so you can see the fence over there. Any locals here can help us. I don't know what this um, stone set up here. So again, so the pump lovely spot. The this, this is just out of um, Maligal, it's the Warwick's Arms Hotel. And you see that large tree up there. That was known as the Corroboree tree, which is where the um, Aboriginals used to come and um, stay. And again, this is uh, obviously 
your gold area. So this is the last of our stops for the tour, which has been an extremely informative tour. So once again, thank you John Tully and thank you Denali. Historical group. Um, Thank you. Yeah.